What up, people? This is Boncho. Today we're in Bergamo. Bergamo. Bergamo, Italy. I'm just sitting in the Airbnb, this old fashioned factory or something. I don't even know what this place is, but it's creepy. But we're gonna go try to find some fine Italian cuisine, maybe some pasta or some pizza. We don't know. I'd like to get some porchetta too, but we'll see what we have around this downtown area of Bergamo. Bergamo, Italy. We're excited to explore it. And this guy's going nuts. Are you ready? I'm trying to get ready, but here it's so cold. You have to wear everything yes. on your clothes. Do you think we have heat in our place? Yeah. We don't know yet. It doesn't seem like it, huh? No. I'm sure I'm going to order, uh, ask for another blanket. Yeah, we're, yeah, we're, we're going to have to ask like, if there's a heater or something. I know I see these things, but we don't know where the button is to put them on. But it's freezing in this place. It's freezing in Bergamo. It's January. And we're ready to go. Let's go see some more of Italy. Our first stop is Pam. Pam, Pam. You want to buy your beer now? It's yeah. open until 9. Nine, should I? Should I buy it now? It's four. It's four? Five hours. Yeah, we'll go walk around first. But that's Pam. That's a good little sneak preview of Pam here in Bergamo. Let's go. I don't know which way we should go. Let's go that way to the main where we came from. What's your first thoughts, your first reaction on Bergamo? Bergamo. Bergamo. It's very cold, but it looks a, a big city and very beautiful with a lot of stuff. Yeah, very nice, huh? Very nice and uh, so, elegant. So far, we, we don't know where we're going, but no. this looks like the downtown, but we can see that there is an upper city. Yeah, we're trying to go to the upper city right now, but... Jeez. Look at this, is this just the post office? Look at this place. If you walk over here, look at this. That's where we're trying to go. Up there, look at that. The upper city. Upper class city. Let's go, Bergamo. The entrance to the upper city is right here through the funicular. Funicular, funicular. Let's go. Beautiful, huh? Right on. I wonder, I wonder how much a ticket is. We're gonna see soon. So far, it's cheaper than uh, Tibidabo Vernacular. This one was three forty for both of us, right? Yes. And look at this old school. And this is an old one. Look at that tunnel. Two. Perfect. Uh oh. <laughs> Yeah. And now, right. gracias. Right. Let's go look at this, son. Look at this coolness, huh? Here we are. But oh, my hair is messy. We're on our way in the funicular. Look at this, eh? It's very cheap. It's way cheaper than uh, uh, Barcelona. Barcelona's 24 euros or something like that, right? It was 12. 24 for both of us, though. Yes. This one was 340. Exactly. So that's a huge difference. But And this one's nicer, it looks like, you yeah? Yes. Oh, lie. look at the sunset, kind of. Huh? Let's see it, huh? It's just cloudy, this window, too bad. But it looks nice, huh? Maybe this way? Ooh. And we got the driver in the back there. See him in the cage, the glass cage. I can't believe how big it is here. Yeah. That's what she said. You don't heard too much about No. I thought this was just an airport city, yeah? Yeah, me too. Small airport. Dang. Look at this. Look at that. Whoa. It's cool, huh? The little funicular. Small. I can't 
can you imagine this in, in summer when you'd have so to big. wait like crazy yeah yeah it's crazy so, i think this funicular is leaving every 10 minutes it's crazy it's beautiful look at this winery look at this this is a center of bergamo look at it huh wow incredible isn't it look at the streets so far it looks like there's nothing open really here uh you can see all the closed doors that's basically what's going on here in bergamo today there's a library a bookstore maybe a few clothing stores but nothing to eat i don't know why <clears throat> you got these kind of places though like a deli we definitely have to try a deli in italy yeah okay. last time we were we were here i don't think we ate at a deli did we a deli is just with all the meat like a you know like a butcher except for with uh lunch meats look at this oh whoa poppy what's going on here? just shoe stores and bookstores no eating stores snack stores too snack stores lots of snacks we just yeah we just walked into the center here we're gonna let enzo run around here put his jacket on the guy refuses to wear a jacket but it's freezing here but look at this all right what do you think it's a be beautiful city it is amazing so far it's like here hold this so far it's like uh i don't know it's like a notre dame or something you know that show with the hunchback that movie that story Look at this though. Maybe we can get something to eat over there. We don't know. Man, look how beautiful this place is. Look at this church. Isn't that incredible? Incredible. Look at this place. Wow, the architecture is unreal. Enzo's pissed because he has to wear a winter jacket. It's like minus one, the guy doesn't want to wear a jacket. Give me a break, kid. Look at this. Wow. Incredible. This city's nice, man. Nice. Up is this little sandwich hut? It's called Babylonia. Yes. Thank you, seven. We got the sandwiches over there. All right, I got a ham cheese, kind of like with like a focaccia bread cut in half, and you stuff it. It's kind of cool. I'm gonna go show you guys it. Maybe I don't know. But look at my hat. I got Angelo's hat on because uh, it's cold, and Nikki lost her hat. <laughs> I lost mine in um, Valencia. Valencia, yeah. And Valencia, you didn't really need a hat, <laughs> but she wore it out once and then never again. See, I think we got these ones here. Pretty good though, huh? Nice little sandwich hat. And look at all the treats too, huh? We should have got him one of these. Yeah. They're nice, huh? It looks like a good place. What do you think? I like it. It doesn't look bad, huh? No, Make he's tired, how, huh? How expensive it is, but uh, I don't know if it's Florence or it's order. A croissant, maybe, a Florence? What is this, though? What are these things? I hope that it's decoration. That's Florence, I think. No, I think they're real over there. They're real? Yeah, look at this guy. He's trying to climb me to get it. <laughs> yeah. He's trying to climb it. Like these. See, we can get this. Want to get one of these for Enzo? That's a beauty. Look at this. So our first place is this. 
<laughs> she wishes she was having a better time, eh? But we gotta be happy we're in Italy. You're only in Italy once this year. Maybe, eh? How is it? Was it a grilled cheese sandwich? Come on, a little smile. So we got this local beer here. It's called Dolomiti Viera. I don't know. There it is. Let's try this. Different. Not bad though. Look at this sandwich. I don't even know what's on it. Prosciutto maybe? Mmm. It's like some sort of cream cheese, red onions. I mean, no, not red onions, red pepper. And ham. And Enzo is loving his ice cream. How about you? I thought mine was with um, meat. Yeah. But it's only cheese. Um, yeah. That's why I said you thought the other one. I'm you want some? Bit. Give me a square of yours. And give me a little square. A little switch. See? There it is. Ooh. I don't know about this one. Mmm. Yeah, I think mine's better, eh? Mm. But look at this. That's beautiful. It's a weird beer. This beer looks pretty kind of though, doesn't it? A nice light green bottle, nice flowers. It even makes the girls look prettier. Well, that was 26 euros for that. What do you think? What a, what a good deal. That's not, I left thinking, what a good deal, but I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure she's like, Here's a free treat for him, right? And then she charges us for it. No? That's okay. I mean, we are right here in the... No, but that's the same thing as like, uh, those as people from Senegal coming up to you, here's a free bracelet, and then yeah. they charge you. Except for this is a Italian store. I don't know. Did we get scammed? I don't know. She said, here's a gift, and then she charged us for ice cream. Rosetta Kappa. But we're going, where are we going now? The other way? I know this was supposed to be a food video, but lots of places are closed and it's cold and it, we're tired. So we're just gonna go to the beer store, grab a kebab. We just had a sandwich, a little tiny sandwich with nothing to it. And um, we're still hungry, so. We didn't want to buy another sandwich for 26 euros, so we're gonna go buy this kebab because there's a kebab stand. I, we haven't really seen any restaurants open. Like, it's crazy. Only a few snack places, bakeries and stuff, a deli, but that's it. Buddy, look at that view, son. Look at that. Wow, I don't know, you guys probably can't see it too good, but look at that. It's beautiful, isn't it? There's a football pitch. Look at a little football pitch there. 
Jesus. And look at a little golf green too. Jesus. That's insane, isn't it? This is cool. Look at this, son. It's beautiful, isn't it? It's beautiful. Isn't it beautiful? Beautiful. It says that it was finished in 1593. 1593, it's crazy, eh? Let's take a look down here. Look at this. Whoa, look at what's behind me here. Overlooking the city of Bergamo. What is going on here, eh? Yeah? Let's go into Kababaru. Look at you feel about having a kebab a roux? I'm just hungry and tired and it's beautiful. This place looks amazing. Yeah, look at it. Chicken. There's a little <laughs> at the beginning there's a little bit of confusion, but then the other the young gentleman spoke English and uh, like but we're gonna have a you know, we're too tired to flight and everything, so it was too hard for us to walk around and try to find this place that's open even especially in old town like you got your kfc and stuff like that but no we didn't want to have that so now we're at the kebab because kebab you can't go wrong and then pan across the street we're going in there don't worry. now we're going to pam we're gonna go check out pam everybody's favorite superstar here in italy we don't know that for a fact but we got seven seconds can we do it Five seconds, let's go. We can do it, boss. Let's go, let's go. We can do it, we can do it, we can do it. We did it. Nobody died. Ah, I love a good grocery store video. <laughs> did I mention that yet? But there's Kababaru. Let's get inside Pam. You ready, honey? You're tired? Here, I'll get this one out. Let's check this. Look at this place, huh? Five euro. Who are we talking? Do they have strawberries? No strawberries. You want some banana nitas? Two bananas? Yeah, two bananas for Enzi. Drop them in. We don't have to... Yes. Yeah, we do. Could have... 61. Look at this place. They even got pizza here. Pizza, what's this? Rotisserie chicken. Some cannolis. Some lasagna. Beautiful, huh? So we're grabbing a pack of water for two bucks. 128 for the Heinekens and then three bucks for that. I don't know how much that is. 42 cents for two bananas. And that's it. But look what I found over here. Unicom. What is that, huh? <laughs> it's crazy. They are huh? unique. <laughs>